check it out, check it out now. One of the most ridiculous things we've seen in the last year or so is when people accuse Gucci Man of being a fucking clone because he came out of jail and he changed his life, okay? He started eating healthy, living healthy, exercising. He stopped basically doing the nigga shit that got him in jail in the first place. Stopped hitting people over the head with fucking bottles. Stopped trying to square up with niggas in Lenox Mall. He decided that he was going to change his life because he wanted a different result other than being in the jail cell, okay? Now, a lot of people say, yo, this thing is a clone, okay? According to many rap fans, and some are very immature and some are just idiots, they claim if you switch up too much from what they know you to be, you can be you. You got to be a fucking clone or something sent by the government. Now, Gucci, man, to his credit, man, he has changed his life for the better. There's nothing but... Uh, kudos and and salutes you have to give to Gucci Man because Gucci Man he has really changed his path. Okay, I mean nowadays you'll see Gucci Man tweeting out inspirational tweets like he's motherfucking Rev Run. He's of course a great family man, works out all the time. He ain't trying to beef with everybody. He ain't going on incoherent rants on Twitter no more. Apparently he's not on any type of drugs and doesn't have any urge to do it. I gotta congratulate this guy. Okay. Now, he was on probation. I don't know if you guys knew this. He was on probation, couldn't really travel as much as he wanted to travel. As time went on, it, it became a little bit more lax that he could move around a little bit more. But still, he was on probation, meaning one fuck up, it could land him back in federal prison, okay? Now, we just got the news that a judge has decided to let him off probation two years ahead of schedule, okay? Guwap's lawyers filed paperwork in Atlanta court asking the judge to end the rapper's supervised release slash probation because of how well he's performed on probation, and the judge agreed. The judge said, yo, this guy's a changed guy, and we don't need that probation program to still monitor this guy, especially when he's such an exemplary member of the community, okay? So basically, after September 19th, he will be no longer in house arrest. He will be able to travel where he wants to travel. He still can't go to Canada because they don't accept felons over there, convicted felons. However, he'll be able to move around without having to phone in or schedule ahead with his life PO. So congratulations to Gucci. Of course, congratulations to his whole family. He's been great. If you guys watch him on social media, you will see how great Gucci's been. And I think he's setting a great example for veterans in the game, okay? We don't want to see the veterans looking cracked out, still trying to fight and acting immature. Gucci was that when he was young. Older Gucci, Gucci has changed. I have nothing but the utmost respect for Gucci, man, because he's showing that even the worst could change. Give the comments, make sure you guys like them, subscribe to Jackie Demix.